What's going on YouTube? This is John with A to Z Diecast, and tonight I'm going to open up this 71 Datsun 510. Uh, it's a Hot Wheels premium car from the new Door Slammer set. It's part of the Car Culture series. Um, I was lucky enough to come across one today. Found it at a local store out on the hunt, and my favorite car from the set. Always a Datsun fan. Big Nissan, Datsun fan, and uh, this was the one I wanted. I really like the, the white four-spoke wheels on it. Livery is awesome. Um, you see the front grill. It's part of the metal bottom. Um, it's got a roll cage in this one. Tail lights on the back. Some nice detail where it's got to be. I love the stripe on the hood card is nice. Unfortunately this card, I don't know if you could tell, I'm sure you could see it right there somewhere, but it's got a little bend in it. That's cool with me. I was happy to find it and I knew I was going to open it, so let's get to opening it. Alright, close that, close that. Awesome. Really happy to come across this thing. Um, you can see the interior, I'm trying to get some light in there. Black interior with the black roll cage, white four spokes. It's got the low pro stretch tires. Um, so what I noticed with these Datsun 510s, you look at the bottom there at the detail, all metal, Datsun Bluebird 510. What I've noticed with these is they come across, they come apart uh, two different ways. I like to customize these cars, so I'm, you know, I'm taking them apart all the time. So this one here has the one rivet, and it links up in the front where the grill meets uh, the body. Um, cool feature. It um, it only has the one rivet, which is nice. Uh, you got the metal lip on the bottom. It, 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 the grill's detail, uh, I think, tends to be a little bit better with this setup. Um, and I have a couple other Datsuns here. Uh, two have the same setup, and one of them is the mainline Momo from uh, 2019. Let's put this down on the flow. Right. Okay, so I have these two right here. Um, this one came from the display case, and this is from the new Car Meet 5 pack in stores now. Uh, this you can also get. I don't know which stores carry it, but I know you can get it online. Um, so the way these two open is the same way. You have a rivet on the back end and the front grill attaches through the body and you seal it with the one rivet. So same as this right here, one rivet, grill. You'd see the grill fits into the body. Boom, right? So now let's compare to this one. This one you can see has two rivets, front and rear, and the grill, this one I actually painted, but the grill is part of the body itself, and this lip here is part of the bottom. So you can see the difference right there. So there's no rivet on this one um, in the front. And I guess I, I kind of made it tricky with this one I'm showing you, but I painted the grill, and uh, otherwise it would be the same color as the body. It was just all red originally. So definitely both nice cars. Uh, if anyone knows any other differences between these, other than like you know painted this and that, uh, if there's any major differences in the chassis and the build of it, let me know. Be cool. To find out. I like learning new stuff. So back to this one. Uh, you can see this has the hood pins. Oh, trunk pins on that. Hood pins here. Uh, you got the stripe. 71. Big 71 on the side. It's a 71 Datsun Bluebird. So that's pretty cool. And yeah. Four spoke wheels. These are really cool. I like the all white. I'm definitely a big fan of the all white four spokes right now. Um, they look great. I'm This is one of my one of my favorite five tens I think. I just it's really clean, livery's really cool. And I'm happy with it. So that was a cool opening. Hope you guys liked it. Please uh follow 
A to Z diecast. What's up, Matt? How you doing, man? Hope everything's good. And um, like the video or dislike it, whatever you think. Let me know in the comments. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.